Hello dear students, we're back again with our spelling lesson. It's about the contraction. So first we are going to start with the definition of a contraction. What is a contraction? A contraction is a shortened form of two words written as one word in which an apostrophe takes the place of the missing letter or letters. So, for example, I will, it becomes I'll. So here, we took out the W and the I and we replaced them with the apostrophe. So an apostrophe is used to show where one or more letters have been left out. And some contractions are made by combining pronouns and verbs. So here, I is the pronoun. Excellent. Will is the part of the verb. So, we took out the W and I. We combined the I with the double L. Between them, we put an apostrophe. It became I'll. And this is the contracted form. A contraction with will are the following. If will is part of the two words, you will replace the W and I with an apostrophe. So, for example, I plus will becomes I'll. You plus will becomes you'll. He plus will becomes he'll. She plus will becomes she'll. So you can see that in all the pronouns, we took out the WI and we replaced it with an apostrophe. So, on my next birthday, I'll be 10. So instead of saying, I will be 10, we use the contraction form, I'll be 10. When do you think you, you will arrive so instead of saying you will, we replaced it with you will, apostrophe double L. Nanita is sure she'll win the spelling B. So also instead of saying she will, we said she'll win the spelling B. My uncle says he'll take me to the cinema. So instead of saying my uncle says he will take me to the cinema, we replaced it with the contracted form he'll heal. Also, with the we, they, who, and that, we have the contracted form we plus will becomes will, they plus will becomes they'll, who plus will becomes who, and that plus will becomes that. Examples. At noon, we'll stop to have lunch. So, at noon, we'll stop to have lunch. The boy said, they'll wash the car. They'll wash the car. So, also here, notice, we took out the WI and we replaced it with an apostrophe. And we combined the pronoun with the rest of the verb, the double L. Now, other kind of contractions is the contraction with have. If have is a part of the two words, you will replace the HA with an apostrophe. So here, for example, instead of saying I have, I will take out the, the, the HA and put apostrophe and then it becomes I've. You have becomes you've we have becomes we've and they have becomes they've also concerning these three words must might and should i also take out the h a and it becomes must might might have should, should've. Okay, so I will repeat. Must, must've. Might, might've. Should, should've. For example, 
Read both sentences to see how the contraction is formed. I have finally learned how to swim. I've finally learned how to swim. Let me know when you have finished. Let me know when you've finished. You've finished. They have had an amazing party yesterday. They've had an amazing party yesterday. So I will repeat. They've had an amazing party yesterday. Let's practice. Write the contraction for the bold-faced words in each sentence below. My cat will not go near the glass. So here... It's a small exception. Whenever I have will not, the contraction form would be won't. So will not will become won't. Do not forget this. It doesn't have any rules, so you have to memorize it as it is. Will not will become won't. So my cat won't go near the glass. Here. We must have misplaced the cards. How do we say it with the contraction? Excellent. We must have replaced the cards. We must have replaced, misplaced the cards. We should have brought our books. We should have. We should have brought our books. That will be so much fun. That'll be so much fun. So it would become, that'll be so much fun. I will prepare the table for dinner. So this one is easy. You should know it by now. I'll prepare the table for dinner. Excellent. You will never believe what I saw. What does it become? You'll never believe what I saw. Excellent. Very good. See you next time.